The Panagia counter is showing distortions in three locations. So what's the plan then? Are we tackling each one together as a group? That could work, but how about we split up into pairs so we can take them all down simultaneously? Great idea, me. We'll draw straws to pick the teams. Who you get is final and I don't want to hear any complaints. So Yama, why don't we start with you? All right, give me one of those things. It's Yama's turn! Huh? Huh? It's blue. Huh? Wait, hang on! Oh. <laughs> I got green! Mine's blue too! That means you're with me. So I'm paired with Tekken. Uh. What? Okay, <laughs> so do your best or whatever. If you guys get into any trouble, you know how to contact me. You were so enthusiastic a minute ago. After having such a great time with Ranking on the last mission, I was hoping I could do the same thing with Yama. I thought I'd finally be able to melt I'm that icy Sorry, you got stuck with me on this one. I'm glad we get to work together today, Yama and Neko. Same here, Ranking. I'm counting on you. Let's do this! We're gonna show them what's what, right, Kaka? Before we head out, I want to make one thing clear. Mm -hmm. If you get in my way at any point, I'll make sure you regret it. You don't have to worry about that. Just make sure you keep up. I bet we bust a hundred Excaliburs before they even know what hit them. <laughs> I guess we'll see. <laughs> Story of six Arthurs who travel to the past. With the help of our trusty fairies, we set out to destroy the one million Excaliburs that are creating space-time distortions. We will continue to fight until our mission is completed. <clears throat> to get going and all, but you do remember that you're not doing this mission alone, right? Uh, hey, hurry up, Slowpokes! You'll get left behind! It'd be much more convenient for me if you just continued running ahead. Well, it's not like you could really keep up with someone who's physically active like him anyway. So let's go at our own pace. In that case, would you be so kind? <laughs> you're gonna have to exert yourself every once in a while or else you might regret it. I won't waste my energy if I don't have to. All right, then. What the? Hey! That's cheating! There's no way I'd do that for you, so don't even think about asking. Yeah, right! Like I'd pass up the chance to do some training. Yeah. <sighs> is this it? Where the distortion was? It sure is. Very perceptive. The Lester Mines. This location has been shut down in our era. Shut down? What did they dig up here? Gold and diamonds and stuff? According to the records, seems like it's mainly coal and iron ore. Okay, so there's an Excalibur around here somewhere? All right, guys, I think we should split up and look for it. I'll go there and you go there. Wait a sec, searching for it randomly would be a waste of time. We should gather information. Yeah, that sounds really boring. We know it's around here somewhere, so we might as well just look. Why do I even try? It's like you have a Valonia Ventricosa for a brain. A Baloney what now? 
Who's that? Valonia ventricosa is a type of algae, and it's one of the largest single-celled organisms found in the world. Wow, that's spot on! Cut it out, you guys! You're using all these words I don't understand! It's hard to keep up! Fine, then. If you would prefer, I'll use a metaphorical insult better befitting your lower level of intelligence next time. Sounds good! How does that sound good? Hey, you kids! <laughs> Who said you could slack off over here? We're not slacking off. Why? Yeah! This is awesome! Don't get like many dependable lads like, like him anymore. Put your back yeah. into it, Sonny! Aren't you getting carried away? We're not here to mine. Relax! We can gather intel without drawing suspicion if we pretend that we work here. Hold on, were you the one who said gathering information was boring? Who cares? I'm going with the flow right now. But it was pretty much my idea in the first place. That's enough yapping, Greenhorns. Back to work. Aye, aye. Right. What should we do now? Let's wait and see how things play out. A little hard work isn't going to kill him. Okay, if you say so. A toast to our two new Greenhorns. To the Greenhorns! <laughs> we made some great progress today, thanks to you two. Well, maybe just thanks to one of you, actually. Hang in there. You can get through this, Kaka. I'd like to request a day off tomorrow, please. Man, it sure is cheerful around here. Everybody's so lively. Well, yeah. Thing is, that's only how it is here at Lester Mines. The surrounding cities are all in bad shape, destroyed by invaders. Invaders? Practically everybody around this table had their families taken away by invaders and fled here after losing everything. We tried to stand up to them, but they had weapons we'd never seen before. We never stood a chance. But then, when we thought we had nowhere left to go, President Lester welcomed us with open arms. He gave us a roof over our heads and work in the mines. Not to mention decent wages. We're all grateful for everything he's provided for us. The only reason we're even alive today is thanks to Mr. Lester. You don't say. This Mr. Lester sounds like a stand-up guy. I'm a lot more than that, you know. Huh. Uh, Mr. Lester! Fantastic work today, men. Thank you very much, Mr. Lester! Oh, so you're the guy- ah! Show the president some respect! <laughs> no, I don't mind. You must be the energetic new recruit that I heard so much about. You're quite the workhorse. It's a pleasure to have you on board. Yeah, it is. Uh, is something the matter? Uh, uh <laughs> All of your dinners are on me tonight, gentlemen. <laughs> and drink as much as you want. Thank you, sir! What happened back there? When you shook hands? Nothing. He just doesn't have typical rich guy hands. This president seems like one heck of a guy. Okay, it's chow time! I knew this would happen. If I were to leave the mission up to Tekken, we would never get anywhere. I'll have to investigate myself. And I'll be here to back you up. I know this isn't a competition, but I refuse to fall behind Doncho and the rest of my teammates. My pride simply won't allow it. For now, let's start by questioning the locals. Excuse me, I'd like to ask you a few... Uh... Pardon me. Arthurs and Excaliburs are getting weirder and weirder! I'm starting to think that I must have chosen poorly. <sighs> How'd we get roped into dealing with this weird type of Excalibur? I'm starting to think I might have been better off getting the straw for Doncho's team. <sighs> Alright, time to clock out! Ah, oh, man, what a day! Howdy! Uh-uh. Thanks for all the hard work you put in. What do you think? Do you like it around here? It's not too shabby. It's lively here, and everyone's happy. We're fortunate to all be alive. Because of that, we can enjoy every moment. I believe it's an important responsibility of mine to protect the well-being of everyone here. So don't push yourself too hard. Treat all life with respect, including your own. Right. So, did you find out anything about the Excalibur? Nothing useful. 
Yeah, same here. Did you even investigate? Of course I did! One of these pickaxes or shovels could be an Excalibur for all we know. So I checked them out one by one. Okay, fine. Thanks for doing your part. But it could be that someone is hiding their Excalibur. In that case, I'll blow my cover and fight with everyone here to flush them out! That is a terrible plan. You'd only cause trouble. It's not like I want to. They're all nice guys. I would hate it if I had to hurt them. If you have any better ideas, I'm all ears. <laughs> Hold it. That. Let me see it. Listen, now, Titania, I kind of feel like there might be a better way to carry me. Please, you're lucky I'm even willing to go out of my way to drag you through the air in the first place. And would it kill you to show me a little bit of gratitude every once in a while? This matter has nothing to do with the Excalibur, so you didn't have to come if you didn't want to. I don't think so! Now that I know, I have to see it with my own two eyes! Oh well, it's not as if I really care. Uh, I hate to tell you this, but... I can't hold on any longer. Huh? Ah! That's my back, and my pride. How could you? <laughs> oh, look at that. So I guess security should be pretty thin since they're after him. Wow, you're heartless. I've never felt bad for Tekken until now. This estate is huge. They've got to be mega loaded. We didn't come here to steal, you know. Huh. Seems I was right after all. <laughs> See that? Looks like I managed to shake them all off. So it all worked out. I knew you could do it, Tekken. What'd you say? Did you find anything? I found something. Um, I should warn you that the event you're about to witness is something spectacular. Good morning, gentlemen. Before we start, I have a report to make. The amount of ore that was excavated in the past week set a brand new record. This could not have been done without the commitment from every single one of you. Thank you all. <laughs> <laughs> that being said, I'm rewarding everyone's efforts with a performance bonus. Let's keep up the great work, men. It looks like business is booming. Lucky you. Isn't that right, Mr. Lester? <laughs> hey, kid, you watch your tone around the president. What's the problem? You've got quite the fire in your eyes. I couldn't care less what tactics you use to earn a quick buck, but I'm not mad about money. This is about selling your product to invaders, and I won't stand for that! What's he saying? It can't be. We discovered this specific ore in the mines. This is Exanium 994. You might know it as a special rare earth element used primarily by the invaders' machine army. That's absurd! Aren't you a clever one? But I fail to see the point you're attempting to make here, my boy. I took it upon myself to look into who your real customers are. You may try to hide them behind aliases, but you aren't fooling me. Lester, you sold Rare Earth to the invaders, knowing full well that it's used to make their weapons. Looky here, if it isn't one of the machines the invaders use. Now why would something like that be stashed inside your office? The cat's out of the bag, big guy. I can't believe I got caught up in your lies. It was only for a bit, but I actually believed in you. Lester, what you've been doing is considered treason. You sold your country out and aided the enemy for money. This can't be true, can it? Please tell us, sir. <laughs> so what if it is? <gasps> I bought both the city and the mine's safety with that ore. I maintained peace and order for every person here. Everything I did benefited the people, didn't it? My profits are the only thing keeping this city afloat. I don't see the problem with that. So you're saying as long as you save this city that you don't care what happens to the others? Of course not. There wouldn't be a city without me, and everyone here knows it. Isn't that right? <sighs> if you all just do as I say, I can guarantee your protection, and I'll pay you even more than before. How's that? <laughs> I have the utmost respect for you, President. But now... The invaders. They destroyed our hometown. 
And you've had us breaking our backs for those monsters this entire time? Well, not anymore! Gah! Damn it! Absolute idiots, Lester. You bastard. Rise, machine! Allow me to show you what happens to those who defy me. to mention. Some parts might be missing. It's just a hunk of junk now. <clears throat> I don't need that pile of scrap anyway. <laughs> Drill hands? It's an Excalibur? <laughs> 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 These drills of mine can demolish anything. Choose your allegiance carefully while you can, gentlemen. To think you are an Arthur after all. It's not like I would be satisfied till I beat you up anyway, so this works out for me. I suppose you must be the rumored Arthur Hunters then. I'll obliterate you with my drills! Okay, give me everything you've got. Let's see how they do against my fists! <laughs> Too. Not yet. He's still got some fight in him. Uh. <laughs> yeah! Ready for some more? I can't understand why you don't help them fight against the invaders when you have all of this incredible power! If we avoid conflict, then no blood will be spilled and our lives will remain safe. That's something learned with age. A thick-headed kid like you would never understand. I don't understand! And I don't have to! <gasps> Excaliburs are symbols of bravery! Take this! <laughs> Those who have no courage will never win! <clears throat> Nonsense! <clears throat> and always taking things way too far. It's a good thing I'm here to watch your back. Who knows what would happen to you if I wasn't around to keep your recklessness in check. <laughs> that was quite the passionate fight. Hey, Doncho. there. Did you have a rough time? I kind of blocked it all out. How about Yama? Don't even ask. And don't call me Yama either. <laughs> 5,118, 5,116, 5,117, 5,118, 5,119, 5, According to future records, that mine we were at today is eventually going to be attacked by an army of invaders. It says... The people of the city were able to fight back and repel every last one of them. I see. The city ended up shutting down because the mine dried up, but the records say the workers relocated to other mines. They sure are a tenacious bunch. 
Oh yeah! We did it! Why, <laughs> 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 what's this? Since when did you two start getting along so well? What? This isn't what it looks like, I swear! You're jumping to conclusions! It sure looks pretty serious to me! Sorry we interrupted. I'm happy for you. Hang on! Hear me out! Listen to me! I'm 